Hi, Wolf Den Vods. Playing Mario Maker. We just watched the PlayStation reveal event, and now we're playing Mario Maker. I'm trying to get my freaking controller to work. Why are you? Why are you like this? Well, you know, we'll do the pro controller for now. Did you have to get a ground loop isolator to put the switch audio into your audio interface? No. I, uh, no, <laughs> I just use the Elgato. Oh, wait. So that, are you saying so that I can hear it? No, I have a, I had this all explained in a video about how to stream from the switch. But I have a, uh, and, and there's a headphone jack in my, uh, what's it called? In my monitor. And that goes out to, uh, like a, like a, like a mixer that has my PC audio mixed into it. Well, this thing really doesn't want to work. I want to see Bob get that S again. All right, you want to see some verses? Is that what you all want to see? We can do that. We can make that happen. Wow, this controller really doesn't want to do it. Hey, it did it. Turns out you just have to do it the right way. Kevin Kenson just tweeted, gonna be honest, not really digging the PS5 design. It's a little bit loud. It's a little bit too loud for my taste. And then I tweeted, ah! <laughs> I think I'm funny. Oh, uh, there's also notifications that I missed. Like a lot of them. Uh, we got Gen 1988 with two months. Thank you. Uh, Decent Californian. Oh, with a host. Willow Davis with the raid. Uh, I, I got that before. Thank you. Uh, Blue Bolt. Oh, oh, another host. I got to stop reading hosts. Luke OS. Thank you for the raid. And NSMPC Gaming with the sub. I appreciate it. What are your thoughts? I thought that was... I should have, like, wrote down all the games that I thought were really cool. Um, Greg didn't leave the Discord. So I'm going to leave. Goodbye. You know what? I'm going to stay in the Discord. Fuck you. I'm just gonna close it on the screen. There were a lot of great games that I saw that I was that I thought were really cool. I thought overall it was a great presentation. I'm upset that we didn't get a price. And uh, I think I like the way it looks visually, but I think it needs, I think it's stupid that you can't lay it on its side. Or, or I need to see how it lays on its side. Just tweet you the screenshot of it on its side, okay. Oh, well this wasn't in it. Oh. That is upside down from what I was expecting. So what about the one without the disk drive? What is this? Oh, hi, Greg. 
So you can put it flat from the looks. Of yeah, it. but that's like weird. That's the one with the disk drive. What about without yeah. the disk drive? It'll just look the same just without the disk. That's I'm weirded out. Oh, we already got lag. Look at that. Hello, too damn tall. Who am I? I'm Mario. Damn it. Oh my god! Why aren't you long jumping? Long jump, dude. What's going on? Get fucked, Toad. This is like the frame rate of that Resident Evil trailer, am I right? Oh my god, dude. My brain can't handle this right now. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho! What? What? I wasn't able to long jump this whole time, and I finally got a long jump, and I long jump into the, the, the side of an icicle. Now that shouldn't have killed me. So I need to like be really careful about hitting the side here. Okay, we're good. Where's the flagpole? Is there no flagpole? Go, 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 Jesus. I'll wait. I'll wait for people. Guessing it's shaped that way for cooling purposes and not just to be edgy. I don't know. I think it's probably... It's got an aerodynamic design. Like, what, is it going to be hurtling through space? I think it's just... I think that's just the design. It's got some weird wings to it. I mean, the inside, yeah, it's got the holes on the on the inside of the white flaps for the for the air to flow through. It doesn't mean the bottom couldn't be flat, you know? Did everybody give up? No. All right, I'm putting you all out of your misery. What Mario game are you playing? This is Mario Maker. Welcome. And we got a, a win on the first game. Look at that. With how simple the PS4 was, the really they really could have carried over the PS4 design and I couldn't have been mad. Again, I like the way the PS5 looks. I just think... Uh, as long as it plays games good. Yeah. Doesn't really matter what it looks like. I just think it's weird. It just matters like, where am I going to put it? Yeah, where am I going to put it? Will it fit where I want it to? Uh, will it go on its side? <laughs> Most people I know had the PS4 on its side. Hello, Kali Motion. How you doing? No idea. So I'm trying to send you a picture on your uh, your Discord. I have no idea. If you want to. Uh, what happened? Got DM you a picture. Put it in the creator uh, chat in my Discord. Oh, I see how this level is played. Ah, oh, you bitch. Uh, well, 
me do a picture. I'll just do a link. Well, let me. Well, let you do a picture. Let me make sure I'm like signed in. On my phone. Come on, come on, come on. What? There we go. Come on. You guys hear me jump. <laughs> Whoo. He like doesn't jump every time. I'm hitting jump, nothing happens. God. Oh my god. Go. Ah. Whew. All right, it helps if I duck. Yo, Juan Decimo, thank you. I'll wait a little bit. Juan Decimo, thank you for the 7 months. It's a me, Bob. Oh, we're lagging. We're lagging. I'm just going. <laughs> if that disconnected, I would have been very upset. Uh, let's see what Greg sent me. Here it is. Thanks for watching. Oh. It's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. Looks just like that. Uh, 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 you know, I thought that was actually the router, but uh, it's got two <laughs> envelopes on the side. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Bob, did you change the stream title? No. Oh, I even changed the fact that we're playing a Mario Maker. I'm going to leave the title, though. Nah, you know what? I'll change it. Done. There you go. A copyright claim was created. All right, so I already got a copyright claim on YouTube for the PlayStation reveal stream. Ah! And another another claim. Let's see how many claims we can rack up for that stream. And another one. Somebody asked before if I was worried about uh, um, DMCA's on Twitch from the stream, and uh, no, I don't give a fuck. What are they gonna if they if they take down my channel for watching the PlayStation reveal event? Then then goodbye Twitch. I'm good. <laughs> ah, come on! I was right there. Couldn't wait. Two seconds. What do you think the price is going to be? Five fifty. Yeah, I was lingering around like the four ninety nine area, but I really wouldn't be surprised if it ended up being more. If it's four ninety nine, that would be a fantastic price point. Yeah, but I think it's going to be five fifty. I think they'd probably take a, a hit if they were to do it for like 500. I think they're gonna try to squeeze a little bit more out of you. I think the Series X is gonna be 500. Mm -hmm. 
But Sony said, it's, it's, the rumors say that Sony was really struggling with the price. Uh, so I think, I think they're going to try to squeeze a little extra out of you. I think, that it, it, I think they couldn't, they didn't have the courage to go up to seven, uh, uh, 600. Yeah. Pepe. PS3 was 600, I think. Uh, I think now it's 599. Yes. Pretty sure. Yes. Right. Or there was one that was, I think it was 500 and 600. Maybe. I don't know. I don't remember if they had two different versions, like one that's backwards compatible and the one that wasn't. No, there was a. Uh, um, oh God damn it! It was two different hard drive spaces. Right. Yeah. Yeah. The the eighty gig had the uh, the back backwards compatibility. I think there was a cheap one that. Uh, I think they both had backwards compatibility when it when it launched. I think it was a, the, yeah, there was a 60 and an 8, and then they had a 40 that came out that didn't have the backwards compatibility. Right, and that one was significantly cheaper. Yeah, I think that one was like $300. And I had a 60 gig, and that, that yellow light depth of, uh, I don't know, I forget how long. God damn you people. Oh my god, this is so annoying. Hey, I did it. Yay. Eep! Am I F now? Did I F myself? Did Xbox release the price of their Series X? No, they did not. Probably not for another month. That's wild that Sony didn't release a price. I think that's crazy. What? Ugh. Rob, you're supposed to jump. You know that? <laughs> you, you know how to play a Mario game? <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying my best here. <laughs> oh, I jumped there and I wasn't supposed to. What should I have for ah? What should I have for dinner? <laughs> uh, just get yourself a nice steak. A nice steak, huh? A nice, nice vegan steak. You know, Blackstone Steakhouse was doing a uh, delivery. Oh, who's this? Oh my God, it's Tim Simpson. Hmm. Greg, it's Tim. Oh, Tim. Tim. How? Fucking stoked! Oh man, he's probably are you right now? He's probably himself. losing it. Probably pissing his pants. I wonder if they're gonna have a VR version of that. When did you know that it was that it was uh, Resident Evil, Tim? Let's start over. No, get out of here, Pink Toad. Eep! Oh, I did it. Yay. Now what, though? Oh! Oh, I messed up. Don't take me to the start. Oh, okay. No, this is the start! Uh. Ah! Fucker. F. It's gonna be a very expensive November. Mm. Are you gonna buy both? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So you gotta. Gotta do it, man. Good job. <laughs> gotta do it. Ah! I don't know if I'll buy both. I got my, my Xbox One for like a hundred bucks, so I didn't really, didn't really care. I don't play it. Ah! 
Ah, I did the same thing again. Ooh, ooh I made it. Ah, I didn't make it. This level sucks. I hate this level. <laughs> Eep. Ooh. Ah, I didn't make it. God, man. Why does everybody want to start over this level? The beginning was bad. <laughs> Am I going to reach a point in the level where I'm going to get stuck? You got this, baby. Oh my god. They're probably stuck somewhere. Oh, okay, never mind. There you go. Your suffering has ended. Uh, I'll boo the level. That was a bad level. I need to watch Mark Cerny talk about the hard drive space again. I can't believe I watched that whole thing. Yeah, I know. That was... Uh... <laughs> I was like, I'm just going to bear through it. That, I, that's what I did. It was really boring. Uh, but I'm going to watch that again. <laughs> so I want to hear him talk about the hard drive space because everybody seems to be calling me an idiot for thinking that all these games are going to be massive. I feel like we're going to be going through the same thing we're going through now. Man, how could they not be more? Even if Sony gives developers the tools to compress, you know... Uh, file sizes developers will then take that like oh okay we can make games bigger mm -hmm. you know that just gives that just opens the door for making the games even bigger Whoop! God. Ah! We're good, we're good, we're good. We're in it. These icicles, man. A oh, real problem. Treacherous. Heep! Alright, alright, alright. God, God, good thing I got that. Bop, bop. Parkour. Gimme. Boop, 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 boop. Why didn't those drop? Go! They're gaining on me. Oh, get me up there. Get me up there! Get me up there! Do I want to go left? I guess I do. Who? Heap. Oh god. Ugh. Oh no. Ooh, that would have ended me right there. I'm like a three We're seconds good, baby. behind you. Good. See ya. I should have waited. I got too excited. <laughs> Sabotage gaming, 825 gigabytes. That's not a hell of a lot of space these days. That's what I'm saying, dude. Hey there, Bob. Just arrived here. Could you tell me in one sentence how you feel about the PlayStation 5 event? Uh, I think it looks... I think they did a really good job. I think the games look really good. I think the console looks really good. Uh, I think it's weird how it needs a stand to be laid on its side. Um, I don't know how it's going to fit in my setup. Uh, I wish we got a price. That was many sentences. Yo, I'm gonna roll today with this.
Bob, do you like milk tea? I don't think I've ever had like a good milk tea. I've only had like shitty homemade milk tea. You gonna buy any of the accessories? I don't know. I don't like the over the ear headphones. The remote, I don't watch anything on my consoles. Uh, so no. Probably I like not. The, I have to try out the headphones before I buy them. They're gonna be like the Sony Gold headphones. I, I, I'm not a fan of those. Well, mostly I'm not a fan of the original Sony Golds because you need a dongle. Mm -hmm. It's very dumb. Hopefully you don't need a dongle with this. I ducked! Ooh, Luigi, I'm coming for you, you bitch. Yo, the thing is over here, you idiots. Oh, maybe it's not. Ah, you fucking toad just effed me. How did they get up there? Oh, God, I'm screwed. You need the key to get through there, but everybody just jumped on each other's heads. God damn it. Oh, I can't even get up there. Give me your shell. I need your shell. Damn it. Come on, dude. Ah, I'm screwed anyway. Well, that was bad. How long until we get other colors in the controllers? I don't know how long it took for the PlayStation 4. I'd imagine it wouldn't take very long at all. I love the white, to be honest, though it's been a hot minute since uh, we've had a bright-looking PlayStation. Yeah, we've never had one. I mean, the besides... The got was the first one. That was great. Yeah, besides, uh, you know, special editions. Um... I th I'm not a fan of the white. I mean, it looks nice, but that's not going to look nice after a while. I have a lot of black stuff, so I prefer be black. Yeah. Um also thinking about how like, you know, like the original Xbox 360 controller was white. Mhm. Mm Think about all the like yellow stain, Dorito dust, cigarette smoke, like used accessories traded into GameStop. Mm. Like white's just not a good idea for something you're gonna use like a lot. I just fucked Luigi so bad. Ah! Come on! Bitch. Oh, I'm supposed to get the car. Well, that's too late. Oh, this was a... I think this was a title screen level. Oh my god, are you kidding me? I'm right here, dude. Now we have to start over. We can't... We can't beat the level unless we start over. I'm not helping you. I'm not helping you. <laughs> I'm not helping you, Toads. Oh, thanks for the help! Ah, you bitch! Come on, Toad. <laughs> Ah! 
What a guy. What a guy this Blue Toad is. Usually Blue Toad's a piece of shit. What? <laughs> Spidey's probably gonna be for PS4 too, though. I, I don't know about that. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. Yeah, uh... They're really bad at backwards compatibility! Oh. Oh! Blue Toad. Thanks. Thanks, Blue Toad. I'm not gonna make it still, though. Nope. Am I wrong that it looked like they showed a black controller variant too? Uh, I think that was just the shadow. God, get up. Ah, oh, come on. Start the level over, man. Why hasn't the oldest Spider-Man game come to PC yet, Bob? Because it's made by PlayStation? Alright, I have to give up. This isn't gonna... If you're not gonna start the level over, we're not gonna win this. I've played this level before. I've been through this. Boo this level. Look, one. You couldn't even title the level. Can't believe I'm watching a Wolf Den stream since it's not already 4 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> I figure if I'm gonna start streaming for the PlayStation review, I might as well get it all out of the way now so I can get my editing done. Mm -hmm. I know what I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna get some empanadas. Or maybe I'll order it after I'm done because there's a place that just opened up by me. J Docs, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Yeah, the, the toes are just wilding out. <laughs> oh, Yosh. I miss Yosh. Me and Toad are too busy over here. Oh, I miss another Yosh. <gasps> Should have jumped over that to get a lead. <sighs> oh, I'm so close to you, Blue Toad! Come on, come on, come on. Fuck! Oh, I was hoping that would be a key. Oh, someone got a key. Mario's in the lead, you bitch. Ah! Come on. Bullshit. It's probably right here, though. Come on! Oh, good. All right. Nothing lost. We're good. In your personal opinion, when do you think Nintendo Switch factories are going to start production producing Switches at the normal rate again? Been trying to get a Switch for a while now, and I'm not play paying $500. Very, very soon. Uh, you Zulert. I talked about it in a podcast a while ago, and people said that it worked out for them. So, uh, Zoolert is like this website where you like you set up alerts for all these different types of like online like retail stores. I think it's Zoolert. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, it's Zulert. I'll, I'll link it in the chat. So you set up the... You set up an alert, and you just leave it open on your desktop. And uh, you'll get alerted when one of them goes in stock, and then you just friggin' buy it. Oh, there's no lag in this one. Oh, and of course, I get effed. Oh my god. <laughs> After this, I want to count uh, how many DMCAs I got for uh, the PS5 reveal. Oh, you gotta be fuck kidding me, dude. I was super on top of that Goomba. I did the same fucking thing again. God damn it, that was horrible. I'm gonna back out because I gotta pee. Uh, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven uh, DMCA or copyright claims on the VOD on That's YouTube. Terrible. Uh, take t one but one from Take Two Interactive, Grand Theft Auto Five, coming to new generation consoles. The whole they they claimed the whole video, like uh, like the whole like their trailer. They claimed the whole trailer. That's fucked. Capcom also. Oh. What are these freaking companies doing claiming their trailers? Oh, and Biohazard Village. Resident Evil 8. Bunch of assholes, dude. Alright, I'm gonna pee. Greg, entertain everybody. Uh, what, what should I say? He's gone. I got really sunburned uh, yesterday. I went fishing. And uh, I know you can't see, but I wore my hat backwards and I have a a band across my forehead that didn't get sunburned. I look like an idiot. I look like a dumb idiot. Hello, everybody. We actually, uh, I think that's what Jerry is talking to me right now. We couldn't finish it. Cause like I went to his apartment. He was like, hey, you want to help me build uh, like my TV stand? And I was like, yeah, sure. I'll go, I'll go and do that. And then I find out that he, him and his wife bought like $1,300 worth of Ikea furniture and then he also lives on the fourth floor of his apartment with no elevator so we had to carry like a dozen boxes to, like very heavy boxes um, so I had to go up like his stairs over 20 fucking times and then I had to build it <laughs> after I did all that I had to Go and start building it. But we didn't finish it because he had like seven fucking things to build. 
like three dressers, TV stand, coffee table. I'll probably have to go there tomorrow and have them finish it. Uh, how hard do I want to play Warzone? Not extremely. I'm actually getting a little hungry. Probably play in uh, a few hours. I'll uh, see if I can get Jerry on the line. Maybe we'll play tonight. And if Bob wants to play, we'll play with him. Yeah, I'm gonna go there tomorrow and help Jerry finish everything. Again. What am I playing nowadays? Uh, it's just been Call of Duty. I'm really just kind of saving myself for The Last of Us. Jerry. He is, is gumshot. <laughs> That's his, like, thing. My favorite game has to be The Last of Us, I'd say. Hi, I'm back. Up. Hey. Um, what show... Are you all doing paid work for? I forget what it's called. Um, it's a TLC show. Um, well, like a, a hair salon. Ha hair slash nail salon. I wasn't under the impression that the game that the games that were shown during the PS5 reveal couldn't be handled by current high end consoles. Yeah. Unpolished. It's called unpolished. Oh. This is the second season of that show. Yeah. Yeah, nothing about the next gen really looked that like mind blowing. I mean the games look great. But yeah, we like I, I don't need there's like a there's like a curve. Oh shit! I need to be Zeldor. It's kind of like the curve of the Uncanny Valley. As close as you get to like looking real, it still looks weird. Like as technology progresses, we're <laughs> like the progress is getting smaller and smaller. Mm-hmm, yeah. Like, eventually, like, the actual, like, microprocessor parts and all that stuff are just gonna... They're not gonna be able to make them any smaller. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we Don't worry, guys. I'll I'll do the whole puzzle for you. So, oh, uh, <laughs> please be the flagpole. Just put the flagpole right here. No. interested in like that 3D audio like I'm not sure if like you need special uh, headphones to be able to hear like the full experience yeah I cuz I I desperately want uh, good audio for uh, you know warzone and stuff yeah oh shit he figured it out I just need a damage boost ah. oh shit yeah, I desperately want good, like, surround sound audio for, uh, multiplayer games, but, uh, first of all, I hear Warzone has, like, 
the worst audio. Mm. Dr. Disrespect just complains about it all the time. Yeah, I have that problem too. Like, when I'm hearing footsteps, I can't tell if it's above me or below me. I hear footsteps from the wrong side very often. Maybe you have the wrong, like, left and right. I don't think I do. In your head, in your ears. I don't think I do. I feel like I would, I would have noticed, like, way sooner if that was the case. Actually, I could probably test that. I could probably just turn on my PlayStation and do a sound test. This is a shitty boss fight. But yeah, I would love surround sound audio, but I don't want to... I love my earbuds. I don't want over-the-ear headphones. I don't like over-the-ears for, like, long sessions. I've gotten used to it. Like my ears are accustomed to being. Here. It hurts like the top of my head. Yeah. If they're sur if they're like noise canceling, it makes me feel weird. It, like fucks up my equilibrium. Hmm. That's interesting. The headphones that I have do that. They're noise canceling. They actually make everything sound a lot louder when they're on. God, dude. Could you just die already? God damn it. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Who liked the Wi-Fi router? That is the PS5. Everybody said that about the, uh... Everybody said the original Xbox One looked like a cable box. No, oh, yeah. Like a VCR? <laughs> yeah. Also, that that's a bad example. That was a bad, uh, console. <laughs> that yeah. was a bad-looking console. Honestly, I miss the era of games like Sly Cooper and Jack and Daxter. Uh, so seeing Sackboy, Ratchet and Clank, and Astrobot make an appearance makes me happy, but that also reflects on what you were saying about graphics. Sometimes the two real looks bad, and I felt like Halo 4 was the verge of that. Um, Astrobot looks good. Uh, that's that VR game that everybody liked, but it looks like instead of focusing on VR... Uh, you could probably play the game in VR, but it looks like they're focusing on the haptic feedback of the controller, which is cool. Because I'd ra much, I don't want to play games in VR. It's too much. VR is too yeah, much. I got, I got a little disarming. It's too much to set up, and it's not. It's just not worth it. Yeah. Like the games aren't that great. Oh, thank. This is a good. I like the way this is set up. So we can't like get out and try to get in other people's lanes. Because people are so annoying. Fuck! I knew I had to move right. I'm surprised Demon Souls happened. Oh, fuck. I forgot who I was. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Thought I was Mario, goddammit. Yeah, I'm surprised we got Demon Souls. I, I was the rumors were saying uh, the wrong game. They were saying Bloodborne. That's so funny. Who was th who was the streamer? It was Casey something. It was the streamer that that said it was uh. Bloodborne. I want to see what she has to say now. Oh my god, this is, these levels always lag. Oh my god, this is agonizing. 
what happened from the beginning of this stream to now. I think with some of the, the games that kind of look like they will play on a PS4 might have a lot to do with um, Unreal 5 isn't out yet. Oh, that's so true. Like that, that, that demo that, that we got, um, it said it was coming out in 2021, so games aren't necessarily being... Maybe some of the games that we saw weren't necessarily being made on it or made with it. Oh my god, oh my god. Get me up there, get me up there, get- How- How are these still powing? <sighs> well, I'm not gonna win, because I'm so far behind these people. Oh, if everyone- Uh, uh. Oh. Oh, Mario dropped out. Okay. All right. Now we have a chance. See, it's worth going through all that agonizing pain. Now we're smooth as butter. And I might actually win. Ah, you bitch. Eep! Ah, you bitch. Ah, you bitch! Ah, you bitch! Don't do it, Luigi. Don't do it. Fuck! Fuck! Ah, you fuck! Ah! Oh. I think I'm gonna compile just you mm. reacting to fucking up all the time. Ah, you fuck! Fucker! Come on! Oh, I lose momentum right there. I gotta not lose the momentum there. Right here, right here, right here. Oh, come on, baby. Come on, baby. How did he do it? Oh! I had that. I freaking had that. Anyway, uh, the person who, uh, the person who broke the news saying that it was Bloodborne. Oh, who's this? Oh, look who it is. It's E. How you doing, bucko? How did you people enjoy your, uh, PlayStation reveal. 30 bits, Pepe plays. Am I the only one who isn't excited as I was when the PlayStation 4 was announced? I just don't feel the same excitement with the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X. It feels like an upgraded console rather than something completely new. Uh, I think people were saying that about the PlayStation 4. I kind of agree. Like, I remember when they took, then they brought out the PlayStation 4. I was like, holy shit, it's so small. Like, it, it has, like, the the size of the PlayStation 3, like, the slim one. Yeah. Because, like, the Xbox was just gigantic compared to the PlayStation 4. So, I kind um, of, on the same... I remember people were saying it doesn't look like a big jump from the yeah. 3 to the 4. Obviously, it was still a bigger jump than what we have now. <laughs> yeah. But um, I remember the explanation at the time was, it doesn't look like a big jump, but look at how many things you can have on screen at once. Like Rezo yeah. Gun was an example of mm -hmm. how you could have all of these particles uh, on screen at once. But we don't really have that for this generation. Well, I guess ray tracing is what we're, is what we're talking about now. Mm -hmm. Lighting. Look at how cool the lighting is. That's really all we got. Yeah. I guess we're just going to have to see 
like a year from now or two years from now when... or when the friggin' thing drops yeah like oh, I was just, just thinking of like uh, since they say it's supposed to be way more way easier to develop on um, yeah that that's true they'll be able to just probably crank out games a, maybe a little bit faster Everybody. Good job, buddy. Thanks, man. Scootish! Thanks for the five months. And thanks for gifting us up to Dutch money. Thanks, my guy. Oh, uh, E, to answer your question. Uh, yes, you can lay it on its side. You need a freaking, like, stand, though. And this is the disc one. I don't know about the discless one. Also, what I was trying to say before you raided me, the person who broke the news that we were going to get a Bloodborne remake or remaster, she tweeted, heck. <laughs> and then not going to lie, I'm extremely disappointed right now. I still trust that a Bloodborne remaster is happening and that we'll see a PC release. But info that it was to be shown at the PS5 show was obviously wrong. I'm sorry. Going to wait and see what happened at the PC Gaming show in a couple of days. Um, I think it's just... That's what I mean. When we hear these rumors, I think... Hello. It, oh, hello, AJ. I think I the rumors get distilled through a bunch of different... Uh, it's like playing telephone. Mm-hmm. Yep. I'm gonna take it with a grain of salt. Yeah. What are we talking about? PS5? We're talking about how I just got a communication error. Oh shit, big rib dude. Uh no, I read the tweets from the person who uh who broke the news that we were gonna get a Bloodborne remaster. Hmm. They said a remaster? I thought they said a sequel. Cause I know uh a Demon Soul uh Demon Souls remaster was rumored for a long time. Um and then eventually that evolved or in addition to that they were talking about a bloodborne sequel it wasn't a this person wasn't rumoring a sequel because because they I'm said that about, it was i'm not talking about one specific person i just know that like a I, rumor of a bloodborne sequel was i'm talking was. about one specific person because she mm -hmm. specifically said that it was being made by uh blue point right 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 that would be weird that's a weird thing to to port as a, a, a remaster, I guess. Like, I, I think I, Demon Souls makes sense because it was like the origin of that whole thing. Yeah, and, and it's and been it's a while. It's a PS3 game, so it's like yeah. a, a, a gen removed. Yeah, and, and Bloodborne is, it came out on, on this current generation, so it's like weird to just like. Yeah, but I wanna. Yeah, to remake it is stupid. Yeah. But I, I, I would like it because I wanna play it. <laughs> Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> just play it on PS5. <laughs> no. Just, just, like, fucking buy it on PlayStation 4. And then no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> then play the sequel. <laughs> Why are you going that way? GTA 5 is my biggest. What the hell? Wait, what? This... Way to start. Yeah, that, I don't know. That was. I don't know if you're saying that as a positive thing, right? What? <laughs> Uh, that GTA 5 was the biggest what the hell of a way to start the showcase because I think that was a dumb way to start the, <laughs> the, the thing yeah unless they were going to be adding like content yeah like I could see Where's if the they key? did that like as like a an announcement tucked in towards the end like the third to last or something like that and it was like a hype reel of like these games are getting like revamped and shit you know mm -hmm. with the power of playstation 5 but like to start with an old game even if it's a game as big as gta 5 seems like it's weird who has the key right now Ooh, what's this now? What have I found myself? Oh! Get owned! Shit, dude, shit. All I had to do was yeet, man. I gotta yeet more. Completely off topic, but I 
tried this, uh, what's it called? The RK2020, this little uh, portable emulator thingy. Mm -hmm. And dude, it plays Dreamcast games like pretty damn good. Hey, I was playing was Sonic. $60? Yeah, I was playing Sonic oh. Adventure 2 on it. I don't know how much it is from Retro Mimi. They're the ones I actually have an affiliate link for. And last night when I was unboxing it, it was like stuttering a little bit, like this when I was playing uh, Mario 64. But mm. I think it was stuttering because it had a low battery. Because <laughs> it wasn't stuttering when I charged it. Yeah, I don't know. I still feel weird about next gen. I still don't feel like it's. I haven't felt like the, their buzzwords have meant even a little bit since PlayStation Three. Like since then, it's been like, okay, this is just PlayStation Three again. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's just because technology really isn't. It's not getting that big jump. Right. I remember going from like. PS1, PS2, playing Grand Theft Auto 3, being like, holy fucking shit. Yeah. Look at this. I think technology, I think technology, I think technology has not caught up to software. Yeah. Mm. I think software already kind of is squeezing the hardware for everything it's worth. Yeah, I hope that the stuff that they're talking about, like fucking 3D audio and like haptic feedback and stuff like that, I hope that plays into like the games that are being made. Mm -hmm. um, but if not, then... Yeah, history has told us that usually doesn't happen. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And it's like, like barely happens. Point, I, I just don't care. <laughs> like, I'll, I'll buy it because I have to, but I want it, it... Like them promoting it as like this thing of like... It's the next thing, and it's gonna blow your fucking mind. It's like, nah, just tell me it's the box that has the new games on it, and I'll buy yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, you don't gotta lie to my face like it's gonna revolutionize anything, because it won't. <laughs> it's like, you know, 3D TVs. It's like just yeah. like a flashy thing for your TV, and then, and then it didn't go anywhere. It's like the use of stuff that they're, you know, trying to push on everyone. And also make it worth it. Oh, you fuck! <laughs> Oof. Fuck! Good fuck! <laughs> fuck! <laughs> fuck! <laughs> fuck! Ah, oh, I was doing so good! Cat said, dude, yeah, that Resident Evil better have actual 3D audio, but I doubt it will. But imagine how sick that'd be. That would be sick. Uh, Falcon Knife is basically... Wait, hold on, I'll go back a little bit. Fuck! Falcon Knife said, actually, hardware is pretty far ahead, but it's really expensive compared to software. Uh, since consoles need to be competitive, they have to do hardware-related sacrifices. I disagree. Because even if you spend fucking $50,000 on a computer, it's it's still not like this brain, like, you know, like, blowing your mind situation. It's like, okay, this looks better, but it's like... It's like a tiny bit better than the $10,000. Yeah, exactly. It's like yeah. what Casey Neistat said about the, like, com the camera, like trajectory thing it's like uh, if you get a, a 50 dollars camera it's going to be shitty you spend 200 dollars on a camera it's going to be significantly better you spend 500 it's going to be significantly better than that but beyond there it's like small like yeah we're th we're there now we're in really small incremental uh changes or incremental like upgrades we can edit 8k video without much of a problem right now in final cut but Nobody can handle it. <laughs> Nobody can watch it <laughs> on yeah. their current hardware. You know what I mean? Right. Like Final Cut's fully capable of editing that shit, but nobody could see it. Yeah, it's crazy because like 
most TVs that like consumers can buy now that's like oh the bleeding God. edge for consumer price is 4K. And then you have like a, a, a step up from that with people that have like 5K screens because God they have IMAX. damn it. And then like there's people that spend fucking $10,000 on a TV for 8K. Like, yeah, you can dump a shit ton into a... You can dump a shit ton of money into a computer. And, uh... You know, Call of Duty won't be able to, uh... Max out your system specs, you know what I mean? But, we're not really talking about that. We're not talking about, uh... Uh... We're not talking about things that are way beyond consumer level. Like, nobody's spending $10,000 on a gaming computer. Yeah, exactly. Hey, Fnatic 4 just uploaded really a video. It's true. But, um, usually that's the thing that's, um, like, impressive about consoles. Like, in the PlayStation 2 era, right? It wasn't that, uh, this is the first time we saw tech on that level. It was the first time we saw tech on that level at that price point. Mm -hmm. And... This is not a big enough jump to like be mind blowing even at this price point. We don't even fucking know the price point, <laughs> so it might not be impressive at all. If they're like, "This is a thousand dollars," and it's like, "Yeah, okay." <laughs> yeah, the idea is that consoles are consumer friendly, <laughs> and I think that, um, like, in an effort to make development easier for third party developers they made consoles move closer to what PC is, and that makes it less impressive in the long run, because all you have to do to see what's going to happen with the next generation of consoles is just look at, like, the upper mid-range PCs and be like, oh, okay, that's what we're going to get. <laughs> How do you pick up people in this game? Uh, isn't it, like, hard or something? Yeah, I thought it was. Ah, uh, okay, good. Now I can take the place of what I was doing before. Come on! I'm gonna die if we keep this up. No, don't kill me! Don't kill me! You suck. The cat says, I feel like we need to give the devs time to catch up with 3D audio and Unreal Engine and all that, too. Uh, like, we can expect those games to be ready at launch, which kind of sucks. But it is what it is. I, I think like about... Like, we can't expect... Can't expect what? Expect those games to be ready at launch. Fucking damn it. I, I just... I think Come about... Come on! Fuck! Uh, Grand Theft Auto 4. In comparison to Grand Theft Auto 5. Mm. Like, 4 came out, like, right when that generation started. Right. And then... 5 came out at the very end, and they're, like, almost look like two different games, quality-wise. So I'm I'm gonna expect the games that are coming out now to be uh, like far inferior to games coming out like two or three years from now or something like that. I think it's great that we're seeing uh, consoles that are more like PCs in this in the sense that it's easier to develop for them because now we're seeing a lot more. Uh, cross-platform play and like you know we're seeing a lot of things being ported to consoles they might not have otherwise been as easily ported to right we would see like the wii version of sh of games instead of like an actual version yeah that's true what is this bullshit ass level definitely like a pros and cons thing i just know like just as somebody that like wants to believe them and the Fuck! whole thing of like this is going to be like the most advanced thing like the only way i think it's possible that, that we could actually get them to like follow through on their promise is if they became more like insular and did that whole thing where it's like this part of the chip is or this like our gpu is custom we have an off-the-shelf cpu but the gpu is like fucking like nobody has this shit you know the problem, I mean, they always have cust like a customized version yeah, of, of yeah, something like that's a, already available. Yeah, like a specialized version of like a pre-existing architecture and like a, like it's essentially like an off the like 
a consumer a, a chip that's available to consumers with tweaks where it's like okay we don't want this feature okay we want this feature uh overclock it a little bit you know like that type of shit mm -hmm. it, it's just that i mean they always these consoles always have something like oh we have you know this version of 3d audio we have a special chip that can do this and developers are like yeah but if we want to put it on your console and the xbox like we don't want to fuck with that <laughs> like if everybody doesn't have it we don't want to fuck with it said well according to sony the ps5 is beyond anything pcs have linus tech tips got in trouble trying to argue it trying to argue that oh god that it's that it's not anything beyond what pcs can do yeah i mean i'm sure that you could yeah i mean it's, it's, that's ridiculous to say it's beyond anything that pcs could do <laughs> i think that I'd agree with that, but at the same time, I I disagree. I think it probably is beyond what most consumers. What the PCs fuck was that? Do, but it's not because the tech is impressive on a hardware level. It's because they're able to use the tech down to the metal. They're able to say, ah, we don't need to run Windows in the background, so we don't need to reserve resources for that. Ah, we don't need to well, use the, the uh, SSD for uh, like. It, it's it's beyond stuff. what computers can do for that price. Yeah, right, right, right. It's if you can you can get a freaking two thousand dollar gaming PC and the games will run the same even with Windows running in the background. You know what I mean? It, it's said it was the best in his class. Yeah, but, but what's its class? Other seven hundred dollar computers? <laughs> yeah, it's it's that's the point of having a console is that it's just a it's a it's for, for the price it is really powerful and really cheap. I think that's the part that feels misleading to me is that they they promote it like it's this like never before seen thing period not never before seen for this price point in your living room etc etc it's this is gonna blow your fucking mind you've never seen games that look like this on anything ever <laughs> <laughs> and it's just not that well, i guess it'll be the first time you'll see this on your couch instead of yeah. at a computer desk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Haven't they been doing that for years, though? Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. I'm saying that since the original like, transition to HD, they've kind of lost the ability to <laughs> realistically market console generations the way that they have up until this point. Mm -hmm. Every console generation up until the HD uh, era was like this generational leap, where it's like games don't look like they did before, period. Yeah. Not like games look marginally better than they did before. No, games look entirely different, and we haven't gotten that next jump, and like, probably you, won't. They still you, market it like we do. You can look at like almost any game and be able to tell like what generation that was right. but once you get to playstation 4 and now 5 and xbox one x and all that shit you're not gonna be able to tell the difference between these two yeah like if anything i like a lot of the games that i saw today but like oh this is the pc version of a playstation 4 game <laughs> you know like I, w I wouldn't be like oh this is a whole new this is a yeah. generational leap you know Thoughts, which was a generational leak because 720p game. Yeah, I'd agree with that as far as like it being a handheld thing. Like, mm -hmm. uh, but it's kind of the HD jump from standard oh, thanks, definition Luigi. on a handheld. So, I mean, they kind of cheated, you know? <laughs> kind of the same thing that we were saying. Like, it's a generational leap for what you can play in your living room on a, you know, small plastic box rather than a whole PC setup, you know? I don't think Nintendo ever markets their consoles like that because I mean they can't. No, they stopped at the GameCube. Yeah, because the game makes sense. Yeah, because the yeah that didn't work out for them. <laughs> They're like, all right, we need to completely change our strategy now.
like Placebo says. I think it's more a problem of they're hitting a ceiling and they're tr just trying to make sales to the people just taking their words for it. Yeah, I think that's exactly what it is. It's it's like they've marketed consoles this way for decades at this point, and they don't know how to market them truthfully. Oh my god, I'm against while Rick. making them sound impressive. You know, like. Like for people like us that are just going to buy the the big new thing, right? All they have to say is like it has the new games on it. <laughs> but the general public is like, okay, but like put the new games on the old thing instead. <laughs> is what's your favorite game reveal of the day, Bob? Um, there were way too many. <laughs> uh. Resident Evil one was definitely like a big mind fuck, but yeah, uh, mm -hmm. what was that weird one with like the googly eyes and the guy taking a dump? Uh, the Octo Oh, that one. was um, yeah, that no. Well, the people who made Octo. No, no, not that one. No, 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 not that one. It was the one that I was like, what the? Because it would like completely oh, change, where it's like you're in a forest, and yeah. then it's the guy taking a shit, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that one. Little devil inside, yeah, that's what. It that was. one was cool. What's your favorite game of the day, AJ? Uh, Spider-Man. <laughs> it peaked early for me. Spider-Man or Horizon One Dawn, dude. Oh, also, yeah, I forgot about Spider-Man. Spider-Man was a big deal. Come Probably on, come on, come on. I, I care significantly more about that IP Fuck. than I do Horizon Dawn. <laughs> Dusk. Mm. Oh, am I done? 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 Uh, how did you? Oh, I completed the clear condition. Well, it was because then 64 used cartridges and the GameCube used mini DVD discs. Uh, that was the reason why the console didn't do as well. Otherwise, they were perfect. I don't know if that was the reason, but that, that, I mean, th there was I think there was a lot of talk that PlayStation was a DVD player, or the PlayStation yeah. Two was a DVD player, and the GameCube wasn't, and then that's why they made the freaking Panasonic uh, GameCube. Right. But I don't know. Yeah, I think I don't know Nintendo about that. fucked themselves with media all the way since SNES. I mean, they could they brute forced it eventually with SNES, but. Uh, the N64 was like they couldn't get through that. It was like, all right, you stuck with cartridges way too long, and that that hurt you on the like on the development end. AJ, what should I eat? Should I have a poll in the chat? <laughs> yeah, do a poll. Steak. Like go go on like fucking. Uh, I'm going on Grubhub and I'm gonna pick yeah, some go things Grubhub, and then I'll I'll do a poll. Find, exactly, find five things you kind of want to eat and say, all right, which which thing. <laughs> And Greg, and we can inflate the the, <laughs> the final result. All right, uh, poll. Uh, Warzone. Poll. I said come on. <laughs> Chinese, um, sal salad and cookies. This place has good cookies, and the salads are really good. Uh, kind of cookies. Chocolate chip. Okay. Okay. Felt yeah. like you're you're kind of you're kind of crossing out the the salad on that, <laughs> but okay. Okay. Except you don't. I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to. That's right. You know, if I'm gonna eat a salad, I gotta even it out with something that's terrible for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. I got you. Empanada. Empanada. <laughs> Empanada. Shawarma. Uh. Shawarma what else? <laughs> oh. Uh, freaking Shake Shack, baby. A hey. chicken sandwich. And if Shake Shack's not available, I'll get Fuku, which is pretty similar. Oh, you have to type these pretty pretty accurately. I said General Tao. <laughs> I should have wrote uh, Gen Tao. I should have wrote. I should have made salad. I'm redoing it. I'm redoing it. 
are the empanadas from? I don't know if there are any. Kate I know, I forgot I'm not, not redoing it. The empanadas are, I don't want to say where they're from. They're, they're from a good empanada place. I didn't even hear you say that. I just saw Kate put it in the chat. I thought she randomly. Well, I was, I talked about empanadas before. Oh, oh wait, where'd my, no where'd my pole go? <laughs> no burgers? He said Shake Shack. Shake Shack, but it, it would be a chicken sandwich if I got it. Oh, you fucking. You know, chicken well, sandwiches are great, dude. Not the same. I was going to say you fucking piece of shit, but it's not the same as getting a uh, fucking, uh, whatever the fuck you got at Five Knack and Burger. I don't remember what I got. I just remember you talking shit and being like, if you don't get a burger and then you got something that wasn't a burger. <laughs> like, this piece of shit, dude. <laughs> Chinese empanada salad and cookies or Shake Shack. You have to you have to write it exactly how I have it out. Oh my god! Oh shit! Shake Shack is coming out on top. Can I put this like? War zone. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a little something. Oh, I don't know what the hell I just did. What am I grabbing? What is this? Oh, the warp bar. Get the fuck out of here. Shack still on top. Empanadas are getting fucked. <laughs> yeah, but nobody wants an empanada, dude. What's up with that? Soy link green. <laughs> Where do I put this? Where do I put this pole? Put it right there. You can barely see it. I'm trying to stack the deck. <laughs> Oh, oh Bob. Oh hi. I found I found an image of it's a weird angle, but it's an image of the PlayStation 5 without the the, the digital version without the disk drive laying oh. down flat. Oh, uh, put it in the Discord. Oh, yeah, you can't really see what's happening underneath it, but it looks like it's flat. Yeah. It looks kind of just like a, a PlayStation 3. Yeah. I think it's dumb that they... <laughs> oh, that's the other thing. Does this thing have fucking buttons? Or is it touch... Shit, how do I get rid of this? Ooh, yeah. Oh, I can't get rid of the display capture. I'm sorry, everybody. This thing doesn't have buttons. I'm waiting a year. <laughs> Oh, I died. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any buttons on it at all. Whoop! Swoop! Swoop! Beep. Does it count? Like multiple volts? No, it does one per person. Oh, okay. And you have to spell it exact. You have to write it out exactly how I have it written out. So salad and cookies was a bad, was a bad syntax. <laughs> <laughs> but I had to try to sweeten the deal with the cookies because I knew nobody was going to write salad. <laughs> nobody was going to vote for salad. Oh, thanks, man. I don't like how Chinese is winning. I want Shake Shack. I got Japanese food in the fridge that I could eat. <laughs> Hold on, wait. You type it. <laughs> I type Shake Shack like that. <laughs> I did it one word. 
Yeah, I know. I didn't know if I could do two words. Uh, I'll stop the poll on my next after this next round. Oh, look at AJ Shack. going in, going really? down on Shake Shack. Why are you voting if you don't even want one of them? I don't know. I'll get it if you vote for it, but I don't want to. I don't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing about food cravings you know if you're if you're like i feel like having this once it's in front of my face i will feel like having that yeah that's true you know yeah well it depends on what it is i mean sometimes if it's, it's like i could just straight up not want something even if i like it I'm like if that's what i got then it's like oh, fuck. especially if you order something and then you get something else or if you get somebody else to order or bring you whatever you order and they fucked it up then it's disappointing and you don't want that shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. If it's just the wrong... If it's something I never would have ordered, then yeah, that's a problem. Oh, God, I thought I was pink-toed. God damn it. Wait, what happened? Also, Dr. Robotnik's mean beam machine if you like Poyo Poyo games. Get in and out Bob. Yeah, fucking... I would love in and out I would love in and out right now. I think Eric was talking shit about in and out on Twitter. Probably. He was just maybe saying it's not, not that maybe good. Maybe Eric was doing the opposite. Maybe Eric was saying, no, nah. because it's either one way or the other. I don't think there's many people in California that are like just like ah, In and Out's okay. It's either In and Out's overrated or In and Out's the best fucking thing you'll ever. <laughs> I just got so fucking hungry. <laughs> God <laughs> damn it! What am I doing wrong here? Oh, I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I gotta do this. See the Ugh. chat. The chat. Look at it. Okay, it is overrated. In and out is amazing. And in and out is the religion in Cali. I don't know if you're. It's not a. Uh, I'm getting Shake Shack. No, late. Back me out. Back me out. Back me out. Back me out. No, I'm from New Jersey, but I've been to California. I had friends in California. <laughs> no. <laughs> Inferior burger. I'm honest. All right. Big Shack wins. PB Retro, thank you for the three months. I appreciate it. Why is this not? Oh, it's the wrong. Okay. And now it has to have like vegan shit. They have to. They have to. <laughs> no fucking way. Could be a business in California and not have vegan stuff. Empanadas got fucked. Yeah, I would have. I would have liked empanadas. But you know what? We're going Shake Shack. Can I even though? I didn't even no. see if they were available. <laughs> Shit's crazy, dude. How did they how did they not get voted out of California with no vegan options? <laughs> oh my god, Shake Shack might not be available. Oh Fuku is though. Fuku's the it tastes the same. Not think it in bananas. Oh wait, no, it it's right here. Three dollar delivery fee. Ugh. See everybody talking about cookout. I've never had that before. I have also never had that. But I want it because everybody's talking about it. So I want to try. Ooh, it's on Grubhub! Yay! It's usually not enough food, though. Should I get an actual burger? I might get an actual burger. And then I'll get, like, the, they have these, like, little chicken... Oh, wait, do they not have those? Hey, but Shake Shack, they don't give you 5,000 fries, like, in and out. I mean, right. and, uh, Five Guys does. They don't no, have the little chicken bites. <laughs> do they have them on Uber? They do have them on Uber. And they don't have them on Grubhub. <sighs> 
don't like that. I don't like how the fucking food service that like DoorDash is the worst because they don't do meals. Yes. And that shit is annoying. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get a chicken shack and I'm gonna get a freaking hot dog. <laughs> No, I'm not gonna do that. I take. My, I, I'm gonna get it on Uber, even though it's gonna be more money. I will get a burger. Domino's, Domino's trash. Sorry. <laughs> Domino's trash, dude. I love Domino's. Trash. Sam wanted to get pizza last night, and I was like, we were looking through. It was like late, and I was looking through all the options. I was like, there's Papa John's. He's like, dude, I would do that, and I was like, are you fucking stupid? <laughs> Oh, but John's is awful. But I've never had it. I like my Domino's. You should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I mean, I I don't disagree with you, but you know, uh, put some pepperoni and bacon on that. Mwah. Manif magnifique. <laughs> Papa John's is death in a box. I'm getting a Death smoke box. shack with tomato, pickle, lettuce. Throw that bitch on there. It's got cheese on it. All right. Wait, you said you're getting a what? I'm getting a smoke shack with a bunch of accoutrements. Gotcha. Gotcha. We're speaking French here now. I'm also going to get the chicken bites because I'm fat. I'm going to get a six piece. Just give me uh, ketchup, Kate, dude. He said, I'm with Greg. Domino's is good. LOL. Their white sauce is bomb. It's trash, but it's good trash. Throw some fries on there. It is trash, but you know, it's good trash. Should I get a cherry blossom? No, it's $6. Get out of here. I don't need that in my life. Uh, I will also get an iced can't tea. can not get a freaking shake, dude. I'm going to get a small half and half. No shake? <laughs> no shake. I'm not getting a shake. Piece of shit. We're good. Get me out of here. Twenty-one dollars. Oh, let's see with the delivery fee. Thirty-three seventy-two <laughs> for just me. Yeah. Yeah. Grubhub would have been so much cheaper. All right, I got a promo code. No, I don't. Everybody use um, Bob's Uber. Oh, apparently I have a Grubhub one too. Got thirty-five dollars for me to get Shake Shack. This is so stupid. But you, you voted, guys. It's all your fault. Man, you can write it off because you made a straw poll about it. So True. So it makes it a business expense. True. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll be here. Your food content. I'll be here in 45 minutes. See, it's not even quick. <laughs> uh, I Let me find my Grubhub code. I want to add that. Oh, NSMPC oh. Gaming made up for it. <laughs> a bomb. Gave me uh gave me enough for my Shake Shack. Now all you gotta do is pay the delivery fee. There it is. <laughs> uh, I'm looking for my. To be clear, I'm talking about paying the delivery fee. Do not give give him more subs for that. <laughs> it is not required. Refer a friend. Share a link. Okay. This is why you should have gotten empanadas? I didn't do the claps. I'm sorry, Kate. <laughs> Uh, custom commands. So I have one for Uber. Uber Eats, yeah. Uber. Let's do Grubhub. For the record, I like Grubhub way more because it's cheaper. Yeah, because it's not $50 to, for the delivery fee. <laughs> and I, I'm like part of their, I like pay for the rewards program so that I get like money back. I want to let me Isn't use the no code. delivery fee for that. What? The like the rewards program. It's like like part of that is supposed to be like no delivery fee. I don't know. Grubhub plus or whatever. I don't know. I think part of that's no delivery fee. Heard from Smash says I love you. Uh, thank you. I love you too. <laughs> Why won't it let me save this? Did that work? Like, 
placebo said i can't believe i'm spending i'm out i'm really out here spending my afternoon watching a man order food yeah man hey man and some people even watch them eat the food it's true true you're not gonna do that i'm out once the food gets here nsmpc gaming thank you for gifting all those subs to alias cube at a small ghost uh Kal Khalil Jama, DNM four one zero, Dan Yell, uh, C Bills, Debauchery, Excited Strawberry. Hey, you were in the uh, the PS five reveal. <laughs> uh, Diddy, that. and Dragon Cho. You're all members. Congratulations, and thank you NSNPC for. Pay, paying for my me out. <laughs> hey man, help Moobot. Bot's hungry too. Did you hear that I got seven uh copyright claims on the uh PS5 reveal? No, I did not. Well, I, I uploaded the VOD. I didn't publish it yet, but I uploaded it. Uh yes, yeah, seven. <laughs> it's fucked from who? It is fucked. It is fucked. All right, let's play the game. I think I got like one copyright claim all year and it was from like fucking Ubisoft or something. So one of these claims is from two, uh, Take Two. It's for the trailer of Grand Theft Auto. They claimed That's the whole stupid. trailer. Yeah. And Capcom claimed the, the uh, Biohazard Village trailer. Oh no, never mind. Yeah, it was Capcom. It was definitely Capcom that gave me my one and only uh copyright claim and it wasn't it was on Parker's video. They also <laughs> claimed being like, hey, can you uh re edit that? They also claimed Pragmata. What's PS5? Oh! I just woke up. It's nine AM. This this cool, dude. Alright, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait this out. The first half had a bunch of ugly fucking- Oh my god, he's gonna things. kill me! Oh, you bitch! Luigi's out to get me. I'm gonna kill him now. Now that I know he plays like that. Fuck. Dystopian Neopets prequel. Uh, a fucking game about strawberry bugs. I don't know if we could say that's a- Neo God damn it. I don't know if we can say that's a Neopets prequel. I think those are the Neopets grown up. Are you th oh, I, I thought it was, I thought they were like the missing link between Neopets. <laughs> and then they got fucking wiped out and then would emerge after. Oh, okay. I see what you're saying. I think what emerges after is us. Are they all at the flagpole? They're just waiting for me. No, they are not. Ah, you bitch. The light of the stream for me was their one black employee. <laughs> <That's the heart. laughs> they had every nationality, but only one black guy. And probably a lot of white people. Probably a lot of white people. It's probably mo like Sony's employees are probably like fucking sixty percent Japanese, which makes sense. True. Twenty percent white people, and then it's fucking twenty percent everybody else combined. That is true. Don't forget the basketball player. That's true. He's an independent contractor for them right now, uh, uh, technically. My food got pushed to 810. Damn, dude. Ooh. Mustafa is bringing it. Almost Mufasa. Almost Mufasa, but it's Mustafa. Oof, no tip. Oh, you didn't tip? That's fucked. I tipped. Okay, I was about to say, you're a piece of shit, dude. I tipped 20%. All right, okay. Off the hook. You're about to get fucking canceled. <laughs> and Gen Z on you. 
to 20% of my already outrageously expensive uh empanadas. He already ordered <laughs> butts. I think he's saying no tip for the name. <laughs> or or because they're they're delayed. It's going at 810 now, god damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. I was hoping that would be a cat suit. Whoop. Eat. I'm eating. I'm eating. Whoop. Oh, I gotta go in. Get yeah, me in there. Get me in there. Are you a good tipper, Bob? Huh? Are you a good tipper? Am I a big tipper? I try to tip. Good tipper. Good tipper? I try to... I wouldn't say I'm a, like, great tipper. Uh, I try to... I was tipping the max when the pandemic first started on Uber, because I was like, these guys are going out here. But then the pandemic wait, uh, took too long, so... <laughs> I've been doing, instead of 25%, I've been doing 20%. Is AJ going to eat for dinner? I don't know, man. I feel like I need to like decide because like if it ends up being a thing of like ah uh, what do I want to eat it's going to default to Chinese and I'm going to spend fucking twenty five dollars. Chinese is the best leftovers. True. Also pizza, it's up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pizza when you get Chinese, forever. you always gotta get a couple, couple extra things, you know. Yeah, man. That's why it's always like fucking twenty five dollars at least. <laughs> I think, uh, overall, I probably default to 20%, um, unless I'm given the option to tip after the fact, like, at a, like, a restaurant, where it's like, oh, yeah, this person was good, I'm gonna tip them more than that, <laughs> but if it's a thing like Uber Eats or something like that, where it's like, I don't know what the fuck this person's gonna do before they get to me, <laughs> I'm like, alright, default 20%. Oh, hi, Jerry. Jerry's here. God damn it. Oh, it's not the same Jerry, dude. You gotta fight the real Jerry to the death. A real gum shot. Wait, yeah, what the hell? That's a different Jerry, but he's just <laughs> as much of an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Unless he legitimately did it. Maybe he legitimately didn't know when the PS5 was being revealed. It was revealed already. That's something Jerry would say. He'd be like, when is it being revealed? Your title says that it, the PS5 is being revealed. Where is it? Even though he knows <laughs> it was already revealed. Oh my god. Why do you act talking shit about Jerry? <laughs> That's what he's here for. What is happening? All right, we need a piece like switch. Back in Horizon Forbidden, I'm never calling it that. I'm always calling it Horizon One, One Noon. I'm calling it Horizon Two, man. That's Horizon Two. What is this freaking level? The only time I can think of when I didn't tip twenty percent or higher was when I got Chipotle Grub Hub, <laughs> and it was like almost three hours late. Jesus! And then I felt like an asshole because it turned out she got in a car accident on the way to delivery. Oh, oh God! One time we had a thing where this is before any of those delivery apps. We had a little uh, a little contest where we ordered from a bunch of different pizza places and had them all deliver the pizza at like 8 o'clock. And we had like a big party. And every time... And, and we had them race each other, basically. Um, and every time the pe like someone would bring a pizza, we would open the door and go, Yeah! And we'd be like, you, what? you got first place! And we gave them a certificate and we gave them like a, like a big tip. And, and the tip got smaller and smaller as the places went on. 
did it at PAX? Why didn't we do that at PAX? Why didn't we play fucking <laughs> Werewolf at PAX? I'm so mad. <laughs> then again, nope, I remember. It's Parker's fault. Because Parker was supposed to bring it, and he didn't bring it. Parker, you piece of shit. Piece of shit, Parker. What? What is this? I will never get to play it, ever. Because the Lord knows we'll never be able to go to a convention again. True. Those are all canceled. <laughs> ha! God damn it. Oh, I got the coin. Good story, Bob. I got Domino's once, and they didn't cut the pizza. <laughs> That's the a, a whole pie. That was the Papa John's controversy. Was it? Yeah. Uh, H three H three got Papa John's and they didn't cut the pizza. <laughs> did I get this one already? You did. Shit. You had to do the first one. Did I not? Oh, the first one. I don't know if I can. I think I need a P switch. Oh, wait, no, I don't. I could just hop on these guys. Those conventions are ch canceled like Jerry. That's who said this. Now this motherfucker is going to try to end me. Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. Get fucked. I don't like when I order, like, a sub... They don't cut it, cause it's like I don't want to eat this whole thing. <laughs> right now. <laughs> the only time I don't tip is when it's a pickup and I got it. Yeah. That's a weird time to tip. I might throw a dollar in if I'm like ordering like a coffee or something at the counter. If I'm just doing a pickup, I'm not tipping anything. I don't have my money out or anything. But if I'm like. At a restaurant or, or at a counter situation. It's usually coffee. It's usually I'm getting a coffee and then I, I throw a buck in or something. Uh, if I only want it for the Sonic 1 and 2, is it better to get the Sega Classic Collection or buy them individually so as to get... The Spin so Dash and the Sonic spin dash one. And Sonic one. It's, I mean, the Classic Collection is amazing. You got a lot of other great games in there, but the, the Ages games individually are probably better. So you'd be spending, I don't know if you'd be spending more. You'd have a better experience if you got the Ages Collection, if you just want to play Sonic, but you, the Classes Collection has a lot of other great games in it that are worth playing. Uh, so if you just want it for Sonic, get the Ages Collection. Because I think Sonic 1 is not that great, and uh, having the Spin Dash helps tremendously. Oh, did I ever tell you about- oh, man. <laughs> Uh, so I went to, I'm, I'm pretty sure I didn't tell you about this shitty story. So it was me, Logan, and some other friends um, that no one knows. <laughs> and we, well, to be fair, not a lot of people know Logan now. But anyway, we went to go get wings at this local place or whatever. And after we all got our food, Fuck! We, each, we each tipped them like at least $10, right? It was like five or six of us, except for one friend who didn't pay for his food. He took part of the tip and used it to pay for his food. What the fuck? I was like, this dude is a piece of shit. Like, he's like one of Logan's friends or whatever. Wait, was did, like, was he that. trying to do that on the sly? And then you like yes. caught him? Yes. What a fucking piece of garbage. I was like, this dickhead, That's man. stealing. Like, that shit was crazy. So what'd you I do? Like, I'm like, yo, what the fuck, man? And then he was like, oh, my bad, I can't pay for the food. So then uh, my friend Ty, he just paid for his food. Oh, my God, dude. Why is he here? Why did, why did, why did yeah, you... Yeah, why invite... They never invite that man out again. That's fucked up. Okay. All right, guys, I gotta go. All right, bye. bye. See you, boys. Baby.
why I don't feel bad spending so much money on ordering food. I don't want my favorite restaurants to close. Yeah. It's a next level mooch. Yeah, this dude's a piece of shit, dude. It's trash. When we used to, like, you know, like, way back in the day when we would have, like, a million people at Applebee's. Uh, we, you know, pass the check around. Everybody would just throw in money. James would always throw in, like, a buck. <laughs> James would always, and then at the end we'd be like, oh, we're a little short for the check, and James would just hide his head. <laughs> God damn. Jerry's one of those two. Oh, <laughs> like, he would get a whole meal and everything, and then he would forget he bought a drink, he would forget that there's a tip involved, he'd forget that there's New York State tax. <laughs> James is a fuckboy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, that's fucked up. And then there'd be times where, like, you know, we'd go out to eat, and it would be only the people who actually pay the right amount. And the tip would be astronomical, because, like, we're usually too used to compensating for all of the degenerates. Yeah, right, right, right. I remember, I think it was just that the service was good, and that was a, a local place. We tip a lot, or try to, or did. If I know the person, like the waiter or whatever, then yeah, I'm gonna tip a lot. Uh, Aaron said, AJ, how lucky do you feel to be Bob's friend? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, AJ. Fuck Bob, dude. He's a piece of shit. God damn it. Fuck! Oh, I gotta be Zeldor. Boy Zelda. Zeldor the boy. What even fucking killed me? Damn. You got an oyster said, yeah, James is a cheap bastard. Fuck him and Jerry, too. <laughs> oh my god. God damn. Jerry isn't cheap. He just doesn't have any money. When he has money, he. Yeah, check them. When he has money, he fucking just throws it everywhere. Yeah, he was. He literally went out. Every time I've been around him, he paid. Jerry? Oh, not Jerry. Fucking James. Oh, James. Yeah, yeah. No, James is. James is good. Now, I mean, he wasn't before. <laughs> Damn it. Irresponsible. Okay, so Jerry's a college student. Yeah, except he, he's never gone to college. Well, he went to college for like four seconds. Like, all right, I'm out. <laughs> it's like being a story time animator. Or <laughs> Jerry and James actually went to college together. They went to Briarcliff, which was like Dude. the college that was next to my high school. <laughs> Did James also stop? <laughs> yes. They both would just play uh, Oblivion on their laptops in class and then fail the class because they weren't paying attention. And they just stopped going. Shipping Virus says, Oh yeah, Bob, you never answered my question because the event started. How did you meet Bob and AJ? I mean, Bob and AJ. Dan and AJ. I told you oh no i didn't actually no that's right i i started it and then i couldn't um me and aj met met uh uh in the kind of funny facebook group <laughs> yeah it's true uh they they did like a submission sunday like every sunday you could just post what you're working on and stuff so i posted my youtube channel and he posted his youtube channel and we're like oh you do youtube too and then we had oh, actually pretty similar that's channels that's true so you posted you posted your video and I commented and I was like, Yo, this is fucking dope. Then you were like, eggs or whatever. And I was like, oh, I do YouTube too. We should do something. And then you're like, all right. And then we did something. <laughs> and then AJ knew Dan before I knew Dan. So that's how I know Dan. It's always me. It's always me. Everybody else is too introverted, even online. Fuck. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm always too. like, hey, I make things. You make things. 
your thing's good. I hope you think mine is too. Let's do something. No, I can't do that. <laughs> can't do that. Fuck! But we physically met at Korean barbecue. No, that's not true. Not true. We... Well, actually, yeah, no, technically the Korean barbecue first, and then we went to... I went to the Switch event after. Oh, yeah. Walk me there. Yeah, because I had already gone to the Switch event. Yeah, you're like, I already like know what it is. A few days before. It was like the same day. It was just earlier that day. No, I went, a di I went on a different day. Oh, it was the same day? Pretty sure I went on a different day. I don't know. That was like 18 years ago. Dude. <laughs> Oh, I missed this. Thanks for the 100 bits. In your opinion, which... Uh, Samson, thanks for the 100 bits. In your opinion, which would be better for playing on the Switch? Buy a Pro Controller or buying the 8-bit Do adapter and using my Scuff Impact? Uh, just buy a Pro Controller. It would work natively with almost every game. It said, I wish I had that confidence now that I'm starting streaming and stuff. I wouldn't do that, but I'm too awkward to. Uh, plus, my stuff is still trash at the moment. Um, I did not know you were a streamer. Didn't know that either. Uh, then maybe that's why, <laughs> because you didn't say anything. It's, but, it's um, hard, because you don't want to self-promote and shit. Yeah. Like, I yeah. get it. You can't be like, gotta go stream now, bye. <laughs> You're just an asshole. Yeah, that's true. I thought you were saying like what, what she was saying. No, 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 I wasn't call. I was no, she did the right, just, everything's good, you're good. Right, right, right. I'm just saying we wouldn't know because there's never an opportunity to be like, you know. Yeah, that's true. Um, yeah, I don't know, I, I, I don't know how to, like, that's not something I can give people advice on, you know? Like, how to be like how I am, you know? Where it's like, mm -hmm. you know, just fucking say so, I can't, you know? <laughs> it's not that simple. I'm usually just like, oh no, I think this is, and maybe that's like the the advice part of it that I can give you. Like, be be about the person before you're about yourself. You know, like don't yes. come, like I didn't come in and talk to Bob where it's like I make stuff. Kevin. Like, fuck the video that you made. No, I started with like this video is really good. I like this video, and then he responded, and I was like, I also, you know, and then that started the dialogue. Um, same thing with Dan, where I was like, I found him because we were on, he was also on TGN, he uh, made a video. I'll also, I'll also add, don't try to force anything. Uh, sometimes it's just not going to happen. <laughs> yeah, that's like, true. Like, uh, you know, uh. I used to like look at people like, you know, content creators that I watch all the time and be like, man, it'd be cool to like, you know, get in that circle or hang out with those people. And then either you get to know one of them and you're like, never mind. <laughs> or you you just grow past it and you make your own little crew. Right. You know, it's not it's not worth trying to weasel your way in somewhere else if it's not organic. Like even with that, there's there's definitely been times where it's like I've reached out to people, and there's like varying degrees of like me reaching out to somebody and being like, "Yo, we should work together," and they're like, "Yeah, we should work together." And then either it doesn't happen, or we do work together, and it doesn't really go anywhere beyond that. It's just like, okay, we made that video or whatever, and we don't really become friends. Mm -hmm. And like the the transition to becoming friends kind of happened the same way across the board with people that I'm currently friends with, where it was like I was like, "Yo, this is dope," blah blah. We added each other on Facebook, didn't really talk. Uh, and except for I, I think I messaged you when I was trying to message Logan about how fucking bullshit Bayonetta was in Smash 4 um, <laughs> and then I came to you asking you about the branding stuff and then from there that's when we started talking more often and then we like just organically became friends from there <laughs> ah you fuck yeah it's good to have you know people doing the same type of shit as you to bounce off of and stuff. Oh, that was horrible. Uh, 
uh, exactly. I don't ever want to be that obnoxious, annoying person. That's why I don't think I'd ever ask anyone to, at least not for a long time. If you like know any people IRL that want to do it to like, if they want to stream and then like you stream with them, you know? Yeah. You don't, I mean, you also don't have to be uh, that outgoing. I, I, I like yeah, Steve Martin saying, be so good they can't ignore you. Make your stuff worth it. Like, make it worth people wanting to be a part of your thing so that you don't have right. to go reach out to them or you don't have to prove yourself to anybody. Just work on your own shit, make it really good, and then people will be like, yo, that's good. I want to be your friend. Oh, good lord. Oh, good god. I'd also say it's a good rule of thumb to, like, kind of detach yourself, like, friendship-wise from, like, the thing you make. Because, like, it's always shitty to be in the position of, like, either you're currently friends with somebody, and because you're friends with them, you want them to like your thing, but maybe they don't like it for one reason or another, and then that affects the friendship. Oh, yeah. I don't think that, don't think that it's worth that, you know? Like, you should want them to like it because they like it, and not because they're your friend. Yeah, that's just a good thing with anything creative. You want to detach yourself from the work that you do. Also, like, not everybody's gonna like... Not everybody has the same tastes, you know? You can't force somebody to like the shit you do. Yep. The fuck? Oh! Get uh, fucked. Uh, shit is really good. Can we be friends? <laughs> oh my god, I helped Luigi, you bitch. He's gonna do it again. Ah, oh, come on. What the fuck? Do I have to triple jump? God. My God. This is very difficult. Oh, so you gotta like, put, can you even do that? Ah. Uh, thanks, Luigi. <laughs> fuck. I can't do this. I don't even think I can triple jump. Ooh, come on, I'm right here, you bitch. Oh! There we go. I did it. Yeah, I'm like really just starting it. That. <laughs> I'm like really just getting started out, so I have no clue what I'm doing yet. Uh, but I'm having a lot of fun with it, so I'm hoping it's something I can work at and get good. Thanks for all that advice, dudes. No problem. That, you have to enjoy it or else it's not worth it, because... Don't expect to make a career out of it. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Especially if you don't, like, enjoy it. Because a lot of times it, it doesn't happen because you made it happen. It happens because it just did, you know? Mm -hmm. So, like, you, you can't start it thinking that, like, I have this end goal by this time, and if it doesn't happen, then you fucking, who knows, you know, right? Like, it, it, it's best to just start it with, I enjoy doing this, and I would do it if I didn't get well, paid to do it. I'd say it's a cocktail of a lot of work and a little bit of luck. Yes. But, oh, God. Oh, but I'd say you're not going to do the work if you don't enjoy it. That's all you got? Two? Okay. I'm gonna get 
a work experience with animals, but it's hard since I wasn't born in the farming business. Small dog mom said, and boobs. Boobs, uh, you know, I can't relate. But I'd imagine that could help some people. Use what you got, you know? It's true. Oh, what a Generally guy. Generally being attractive can help people. It's <laughs> true. I'm going to do one more level, I think. Then I'm just going to sit by the door and wait for my food like I'm a dog. <laughs> Is it food time yet? <laughs> it's almost food time. I am starving. I'm fucking starving. Artoonie says, how are you so good at this game? Don't fucking lie to Bob. I just lost. Back to installing flooring in the house later, peeps. That sounds like hell. Sounds like I would not want to do that. Damn. My I've been streaming for longer shit. than three hours. I've been streaming for four hours. Have you... Yeah, it it just uh uh it cut out for a second. Give me yes. How do you accent? Wait, if being attractive helps, how did you get half a million? Just kidding. <laughs> it was uh, Will. Yeah, it was all Will. Will did it. <laughs> Yo, pink toad man. I hope you got screwed. Will's baby's gonna get you the next half a million. <laughs> They refuse. They refuse to show the baby. Yeah. Ah, yeah. damn it. Damn it. All right, I'm doing one more. <laughs> that was too quick. What are you getting to eat? He got uh, Shake Shack. By popular vote, I got okay. Shake Shack. But, I mean, but you stacked the deck, dude. I did. I did. I did it on purpose. I did not stack the deck for voting what game to play, though. I actually tried to stack the deck towards Mario 64 because I would have beaten it today if I played that. Those are not for views. Yeah, I did want to play Warzone. Or did Greg? <laughs> Rip Greg. Rip. New Rip season, Greg. new season of Warzone. Took 30 gigs to download. But apparently it only takes up four. have they done? Because I feel like... Apparently like, four. Even... And the game freaking like came out in like March or something. I'm so like, I'm progressively more detached from each uh, fucking uh, Battle Royale game. Because I feel like I knew, even though I didn't play it, like I knew like, okay, Fortnite's at this many seasons. And then it was like fucking what? PUBG or PUBG was before that, I guess. And then Fortnite, and then like Apex Legends or whatever, and it's like okay, vaguely I understand how many seasons there are. I didn't even know fucking Warzone even was doing seasons. I had no. Clue. I think seasons are stupid. Call it something yeah. else. Yes. Just call it a version number. You know? Aren't they saying something about like the next Call of Duty having Warzone? But like that's like, isn't Warzone a standalone thing? Warzone is a standalone thing, but it's part of. Oh, I should have gone through that. I'm so stupid. Warzone is a standalone thing, but it's part of uh, Modern Warfare. Like it, like it uses all the same assets as Modern Warfare. Okay. The, the, what the? Are they just gonna update? <laughs> Uh, the same app and then add another fucking 50 gigs or whatever like here's the new yeah. assets yeah probably I fucked up 1-1 one, one. unless they're all waiting for me oh no this is uh, not 1-1 one, one. oh no it is it is I wonder God. how many 1-1s one, there are in this game I know I guarantee there's a super world that just have has one once. <laughs> there's at least oh. one super world. It wasn't just one one, there was more. There's probably all of world one. What the fuck? 
I hope they move Warzone to PS5, like immediately at launch. Uh, I mean, and then they, they keep Warzone standalone and just update it when the new game comes out. How, yeah, how would that work? Wait, because I don't think uh, PS5 technically has smart delivery. No. So they would have to make would a new look? game for like a new app. Like the, they would have to port it to PS5. Weird. Just like Fortnite, you know? Yeah. But like on Xbox, at least on the consumer side, it would just be downloading the regular ass Warzone. And That's then whenever true. they update it, it'll be that Series X version. That is true. Uh, all right, who's on right now? Uh, Plague Placebo says, we should own the PS5, but the next Xbox also looks like a router, so they're both ugly looking. They, I mean, that's the first thing that I said, was that they, they it's, we, it's so weird. They share one brain, a singular brain, because when, at, when we saw that the Xbox looked like a, a PC tower, it was like, that's weird. Uh, at least PlayStation's not going to do that. And then they fucking did it. <laughs> like, made them both come to the conclusion that their next console needs to look like a PC tower. There is nobody on right now. Jenna is Eric. <laughs> She's playing Call of Duty, though. Man. So, uh, that's like Mario in some cultures. <laughs> Anybody play Mario Maker? Love your streams. Osty, no. <laughs> He's not on. Alright, the egg said, Kate, go stream so Bob can raid you. <laughs> Brody animates live. Who is this? I don't like raiding people. You suggest I need to vet these people. <laughs> oh, what was that noise? He's playing Minecraft. That person. All right, I'm not raiding anybody. Dude, fuck all y'alls. I'll probably see you Saturday. Go watch my video. Let's raid my video. Raid AJ's <laughs> video. Uh, I don't know why I decided. Let's go to AJ's Twitter. That'll be the easiest way. Probably would be. Um, you got to pin it. You don't have it pinned. Ugh. Uh, oh, yeah, I remember. It's because it's fucking ugh, Twitter. Ugh. Actually, and the Fanatics 4 YouTube didn't. Uh, the Fanatics 4 Twitter didn't link it. <laughs> in the tweet yeah i know that's what it got because i was fucking rushing to do it it's dumb and i hate everything tweet it again but uh everything sucks playstation 5 also in the bio the playlist that you have is going to a, a video and not the, the playlist uh, yeah i know because it links to the playlist as a part of the video, but I got the link. You got a lot of problems, man. You got a lot of uh, problems. It's, it's dumb because you Go can watch AJ's video. video. There it is. There it is. Which one's video? Choose some Switch games, fam. I'll see you later. Goodbye, everybody. Bye.